Well, time for your chat to brief, a look at some of the stories making headlines in Chinese media. Great time to really get John Liu on, on the show here today. You're looking through some of these local papers. How are they, in particular, when it comes to the top story for us today, how are they covering these attacks on Israel? Well, it's been relatively muted, Javon. So here we have the Global Times, and you'll see uh, the headline here in Chinese is just that uh, the Iranian attacks on Israel have uh, affected the world. Uh, I, I would note, though, in this Chinese headline, there's a little, little subhead over here that says, uh, that describes the American response as being extremely subtle. And so th still taking some opportunities to uh, get the Chinese side of the story in there. Yeah, interesting. Um, there's also, just the timing of, of the German Chancellor, Olaf Scholz, is heading over to where you are for a, a three-day visit. I mean, how are people, how is that being covered in, in terms of what to expect? Uh, so he's on the front page as well, but just sort of on the side here, uh, on the back, uh, you'll see, here's a picture of Mr. Schultz. Uh, the, what the Chinese papers are saying is they are emphasizing that this is an economic visit. Uh, they are saying, for example, in the Global Times here, that he's going to be in Shanghai and Chongqing and then in Beijing. So they're saying two days of economics, one day of politics. So the focus on getting the trade relationship <laughs> right. Yeah, and you got to wonder, I'm, I'm guessing EVs are going to make it part of that conversation, maybe, if we get any sort of details yes. there. Um, there's an interesting thing from that state council meeting, or at least a statement that came out about stock market supervision. What can we glean from, from that statement? So we have gotten uh, all the business newspapers are, are featuring uh, the state council and what they put out uh, uh, late on Friday. Uh, they are referring it to it as sort of one plus n. It's just a reference to uh, what the state council did and then what the CSRC and various other entities in China did, the stock exchanges. Uh, they are also making the point that IPOs, IPOs are a front line, mm. tightening, strengthening regulation on IPOs. They are calling a front line to supporting the market. And they are also, uh, for example, in the Shanghai Securities News today, there's a little article on the front page here saying that the economic situation in the first quarter is getting the year off to a good start. Whether or not that is true, we will find out tomorrow, obviously, when we get mm. GDP and lots of other data. All right. Thank you. That was a, that was a great sort of brief on, on everything. It was great to have that show and tell today. John, thanks so much.